Welcome to Near Reality. The biggest server out there, peaking at well over 2,000 players online. And with the return, this game is doing amazing. Link down below if you do want to hop on. And as well today, I've got a crazy giveaway. One lucky winner is going to walk away with a free $25 donator pin. As well, if we manage to hit 150 likes on today's video, I'm going to add a bonus Lime Whip to today's giveaway. One of the most sought after items on this game, so of course show the love. Either way, if you want an entry on today's giveaway, make sure to like the video, comment your new reality IGN down below, and of course subscribe to the channel. Of course, hope to see you online, and I really hope you enjoyed today's video. I hate to see it. 46 KC for a third Ceridoman's Light. What do you mean? Honestly, I'm gonna consume this one. I have dropped both into the forge. Don't get me wrong, they're great remnant points. But I'm thinking at some point, I'm gonna need a Hasta, so it's... It's cope. Smile. It was something useful. A bit of cope. Man, I'm 46 KC with three lights. Get out of here. I hate them. Okay. You're just... You're cringe. Four and 48 KC. Okay. Whatever, it's remnant points. It's... God damn it. Brother. Brother. I didn't even know what happened. Brother. Okay. Well, uh, time to make another ring of life. Do, why am I... Holy shit. Why am I so bad at this game? I've been ring of life 40 times. Jesus Christ. Quickly consuming a Ceridoman's Light. And other one scraps for another 275 points. Gimme, gimme. Ah. Task complete. And I got a Slayer Casket. And a blue plate. I thought I got a drop. I, I got a task for 50 KC. Smile. Brother! I mean, it's a collection log. I'll take it. God's Orchard 1 to the account. Getting lucky so far. 52 KC. Yo! Let's fucking go! That's actually massive! 61 KC for a uh, hilt? Okay. Sarah Godsword unlocked. Let's fucking go. I will take that. I still mainly want the ACB, but fucking huge. That's actually gonna help so much on PVM, I'm not gonna lie. Now I have Excalibur and Hilt that both heal me. Another task done, 30 points. And we take the blade. Brand new Sarah Godsword unlocked. God damn. That's actually so cool. Love to have that. I'm kinda curious. A thousand points right there, brother. God damn. And log looking pretty good. Four out of eight so far. Yo, I completely forgot about the Sarah Sword. God damn. Missing one blade, Sarah Sword, of course, the ECB, and pet. Also, I've done two out of five tasks. Kill all bodyguards and Zilly. Kill her a hundred times. Don't take any damage. And 50 times without leaving the room. Okay. Either way, we regear and go hunt the ACB. Task picker, Simona. Commander Ziliana, another 35. Wish us luck. Oh, oh. Eh, good enough for now. Again, back to Zilly on the hunt for the ACB. Dude, I swear, I'm gonna pull every drop until the ACB. 65 KC at the moment. Not really care if I pull pet. Two M boxes would be cool, not gonna lie, but off we go. Now, too, before anything, recent votes in. And I'm kind of curious what I got for points. Another four, another four tomes. 17 tomes is a ton of remnant points. I'm telling you, on an Iron Man, make sure to get your votes in for the day. It is super smart. The majority of my remnant points have literally just been by voting. Sitting on another 1375 points. And perk-wise, I'm not 100% sure what I'm going to go for next. I've already got the majority of the good ones. Crystal Catalyst, Slayer Spite, one tick increase on Crossbow. Like, all the good early ones I'm already stacked up on. Although, I do think it would be smart to save up 15k for the Blood Fury effect without requiring the equipment. Kind of expensive, but again, passive healing effect is huge, especially when my dumbass dies 14 times a day. Okay, back to back elite clue, then a god sword shard one. Not the one for log, but another one. I'll take it. I'm pretty sure I can actually scrap the full blade itself for a ton of points, so it is what it is. I'm feeling it, dude. I'm feeling the luck on this trip, 100%. Ah, time for a break. Got a Xamphor up. Again, if you don't know, Xamphor is so strong. Has chances at Lime, Death Cape, Dragon Kite, Ten Bond, and a ton more. And even if you hit nothing, you still get free tomes of XP for free remnant points. Come on. Food supplies, I will take that. Either way, back to Sarah. Nah, what do you mean? Just pull the God Sword Char 2 from a minion. I don't even want to know how rare that shit is. God damn it. Ah, uh, no. I just sat down. 
Alright, we got time. Never want to miss a Zamper, dude. I'm telling you. And there are so many fucking people. Goddamn. Come on. Yeah, more supplies. I will take it. And for boosts off that, we got Nuggets and Volcano. More importantly, clue reward bonus is on. Eh, I don't have many, but three mediums, one elite. I can't lie, there are some huge chances at a ton of points from elites. And again, soon TM, maybe pull rangers eventually. Yeah. Uh, do I have any skips? Nah. Do the elite first. I love rune light. Big. And next one, finish a clue. Also still have clue booster active for 15 clues. With the event on, come on, big. Bro, clues are insane. I mean, it's trash, but clues are insane. New collection log. Gimme, gimme. I will say, though, the SGS actually helps out a ton. Kinda opens up the door for some really good bossing now. I do want to start Hydra. Before Hydra, though, is probably going to be a bit of a zammy sesh. And honestly, at this point in my account, I'm probably just going to start getting random tasks from Simona and run actual boss slayer. As well, pretty much all of my AFK time recently has been spent at the Vyres. I'm a good 1500 KC without a single shard, which does suck. The first one I do want to keep to make a Blood Fury. Although, it is an insane actual remnant point farm here too. Every crystal is an extra 900 points to grab more perks and love it. So yeah, pretty much all hours of AFK, half editing, make sure I got a ring of life but half doing anything. I camp away at the virus and pray to break the goddamn dry streak. I am realizing I have a ton more Slayer to do. More importantly, Slayer statuettes. The ability to mount the Slayer helmet on statues. I will need four pieces of the Slayer statue. I have one from Kraken, others are Serb, Hydra, and I think Thermo. But then I can throw the Slayer helmet on the statue, have that permanently in game too. But more importantly, I need an Arc Light. Dark Light is 400 points. Things like Holy Wrench, like honestly, Slayer is overall super strong. Wait, D Hunter gloves would be cracked actually. Oh, thank fuck I checked. I can buy it for coins. Either way, off to Arceus Slayer to make the Arc Light, and time to go prep some Zami, because I am quite bored of Dry at Sarah at the moment. No, but seriously, Near Reality is crazy fun to play. If you haven't already, be sure to hop on by using the link down below. If you guys haven't seen already, I've actually been posting and streaming this game super consistently. Trust me when I say it, this is probably my favorite game to play lately. Hope to see you online. And of course, don't forget about that massive giveaway, and as always, to join mine in the Near Reality Discords by using links down below. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video, and later!